Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. So I finally made it back to the Friday Night Classics here. Uh, I wasn't sure if I was going to get back to this event or not, but uh, I'm glad I did. I actually had to juggle some stuff around and I made it back out and it's a beautiful evening. This thing is well attended. A lot of cars here tonight. Uh, I'm going to do a little skirt around here and, and show you what showed up. And we'll kind of, you know, as, as before, we're going to key in on some special unique cars so a lot of guys are still showing up here tonight you can see them pulling in real pretty cars here tonight there is a ton of stuff going on in saskatoon and the saskatoon area there's car shows and events all over the place this weekend uh, i'm not going to even try to uh, list them all i know uh, definitely there's a hop night on saturday night in saskatoon there's also uh, uh, watchress Watcher Saskatchewan, there's a show and shine there. Radisson Saskatchewan, there's a show and shine there Sunday. And, uh, oh gosh, I'm gonna miss a few there. Ben Go, there's one in Ben Go, Saskatchewan. They're all over. And of course, there's this event here, Friday Night Classics, uh, Markham Mall, Saskatoon, Preston Avenue. So I'm gonna show you guys some cars here. A little bit of everything. The 66 Chevelle is real impressive. Really pretty. I don't know that I've seen this before. LS Power. And I'm a big fan of this Impala here. Big block car. Very pretty car. All right, lots of cars to get through here, guys. And the crowds are thick. Some occupying the space in the corner. Uh, oh, there's Terry with his Cuda. Scoot in with us here. It's a little breezy tonight, guys. I apologize if the audio is a little sketchy. It is windy tonight, but it's a super beautiful evening just the same. Nice little T-Bird. I don't know that I've seen this Cadillac before. Really pretty. Fifty-five. Ted brought his car out tonight. It's a nice hot rod. Some of these we have seen before. Oh, I don't know that I've seen this before. Oh, windows are up, can't see in there. That's really pretty. Yeah, Norm's car, we did a walk around video on that one. There's a lot of people here tonight. It's going to be tough to get a close look at everything. I don't know that I've ever seen this Fairlane convertible before. That's new to me. Looks like a really nice original car. Let's see if we can get a look at the interior. Interior looks all fresh. Yeah, it's pretty. Very nice car. Very, very nice. Ah, super nice Meteor. I know we've seen this one before. Wow. That's a beautiful car. This, I've never seen this before. This is new to me also. Windows are down, so we'll have a peek. Yeah, this is nice. That is really cool. And so is this. Oh, we got 
some music playing there. I gotta watch myself with that. I got a copyright strike with my warming video. <laughs> Gary's Nova. We've seen this Pontiac here before and this GS. This is a absolutely stunning Edsel. This car has been to our shop. Uh, I did do an alignment on this a few years ago, a number of years ago. It is just a, a beautiful car. I really like the colors on there. Nice little Mustang. Oh, Doug's pulling in with his 69. Chevy trucks here. And we have seen that one. I like that truck. That's nice. I've seen this Pontiac before. I've never seen the hood up on it. Really pretty. Nicely detailed. Yeah, I like that car. An excursion and we're almost to the end of this row here we've got a Corvette and big block Impala 427 car and an MG it's well attended tonight there's a lot of cars over here cool little Chevy too Chevy T four door, a really nice original car, and another. This is a Nova SS here, small block. I don't think I've seen this car before either. Ah, uh, that's an automatic buckets and council car. That's really nice. Uh, this little car I've seen before, actually I did an alignment on this car when it was fresh. This, uh, this is an amazing build. This has got all, a lot of race car technology underneath it. I could tell you that there's a lot of trick stuff in this. It's LS powered. There's a lot of carbon fiber in this car that you don't see actually. Uh, the hood, the fenders, everything is carbon fiber and it's painted. Uh, there's a, you can tell on the mirror there, that's about the only exposed piece. And the dash is carbon fiber in there as well. I don't know if you guys noticed that. Pretty, prettiest pearl white paint job on it. That's a radical build right there. That's, it's a really neat car. And what else do we have here? A little Mustang. Uh, this one we've looked at before. This is a really, really nice hot rod. This one's also been to our shop. Really pretty. California kid looking. This one also has been to our shop here. This is probably This is probably the most sought after. Neat hot rod. Ton of round, dual four, small block. That is a stunning Cadillac. I don't think I've seen this car either. And the windows are up. I can't really show you much there. Just a super pretty straight black. That's really nice. Ah, a couple of dailies in here. We have seen this little hot rod before. A Pontiac with a Corvette engine in it. It's really different. I like it. 
go in and get a part. <laughs> they still got my old 86. Anyway, say hi to Mark and everybody. I'm still And I believe this is one of Sean's cars, Sean Decay. Really neat. He's got, he's the lowrider king here. I believe this is one of his. This is really pretty. Wow. Those lowrider cars are the most amazing, detailed, custom cars I've ever seen in my life. And we have seen this one. This one appears on the channel. This is a really pretty 69 Camaro Rally Sport. We did a walk around video on this one uh, a couple of years ago. It's a beautiful car. And Paul's 55. We got a Crown Vic there, I believe, with some interesting artwork on it. Real pretty square body. That's nice. And Daryl's truck. We have done a walk around video on this one. You guys can check for that on the channel. It's in the playlist. And we have looked at this before. This one's in the middle of a restoration. It's the prettiest Lincoln. The V12. This fellow apparently owns two of them. One's an unrestored car, and then he has this one here that he's in the middle of restoring. And there's uh, some of the just a button on there and inside the interior as well to open the doors it's just a straight up button kind of neat technology back in the day on the Lincolns that's a beautiful car just something you don't see 41 it's a beautiful little hot rod Uh, I can't get very close to that one. That's Gary's uh, big block Camaro. Little Mercedes, pretty little T-Bird here. Don't know that I've looked inside this car. This is kind of new to me here. Ah, the swing away steering column. Really nicely restored car. I did see this at a hop night two weeks ago. And I probably bought another Very pretty. Nice little Pontiac. Four door. And a Monza. We have seen this Meteor before. Really cool. Very Blair's car. Super pretty. A very, very, very clean car. I love the wheels on there. That was custom here. Radical custom. And we got a camper squeezed in here. And we're almost to the end of the row. We've got a 71 Monte Carlo. I don't know that I've seen this car before. It's actually a really clean, really straight car. Very nice. And capping off the row, we got Travis's 70 Chevelle. Prettiest 70 Chevelle. We did a walk around on this one also. And we have Tim's Roadrunner. He doesn't get out much with this. I really like this car. This is a really sweet car. Buckets Council. He doesn't have the hood open here, so I can't remember if this is a, a 383 or a 440 car. I just, I don't remember. But I like it. It's just a pretty nice, honest, 
muscle car. He's got the Magnum style wheel on there. Yeah, a lot of neat stuff here. Oh, we got another truck that just kind of snuck in behind me here. I haven't seen this. Yeah, that's really nice. Prettiest color blue on there. Looks nice in the sun. Yeah, guys, so, yeah, they're still pulling in here, but that's the majority of the cars here at the uh, Friday Night Classic Saskatoon uh, Preston Avenue Market Mall. It's actually a really good turnout. It's a beautiful evening. I was glad to finally get out. Like I say, I don't usually get out to these weekday deals, but I made a point of coming here again because it's so well attended, and it's, it's such a beautiful evening. I just couldn't couldn't not come so anyway i was really glad to be able to share this with you guys hope you enjoy it and uh we'll see you again thanks for watching